No. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Saint break. Good boy. Good boy. Good. Sit. Good boy. Good boy. That was so good. That was. was so good. I didn't even, I didn't even have it in my hands. That's how good you are. Good boy. Saint crate. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Continuing to put the leash back on. To see if it makes him be pushy and come out, right? Gotta slow down. You can't just because I have a leash on doesn't mean you just come out. If he but if you came, I would close that in his face. And I would match his energy. If he's trying to creep, I just do that. If he's barreling out, I'm coming a little quicker, right? Uh, the point is, is not to hurt them, of course, but to just, whoa, there's a consequence to coming out of the crate and being rude about it. And it really helps pattern every time you come out of the crate, the expectation, the expectation is to be calm, not, whoa. Good boy. Good boy. Break. And even that needs to be calm. Even walking out. Even when I do give the break command, you're not just going to barrel out. If you do, I have the leash, and the leash would just get tight. He'd run. He'd, he'd come out too quick. The leash would just be there. Good boy. And then, put him back in. Moment. Break. And he'll slow down. Okay. Good boy. Now, I probably wouldn't let it pull, like, real hard. I would just hold, like, as soon as he came out, it would just be constant. To, and then he wouldn't be able to like run away, right? So he's not gonna hurt himself and just go to the end of the rope and pop. It's gonna be like, whoa, Nelly. And he's like, whoa, okay, okay. It's getting tighter the more I run away. Good boy. Break. So I don't actually have heal yet, so I don't want to be spoiling the word. So I'm just gonna use break and break him. Good boy. Crate. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So eventually, we'll be patterning a uh, down in here. Uh, that actually happens tonight, I believe. No, tomorrow. Um, he, he's already calm, he's good in the crate, so I'm not gonna ask for the down right now. Um, when I start patterning the down on, uh, on place today, today, um, and, and we'll, uh, we'll start asking for it in there. I can't ask him for it if he doesn't know, right? So, <clears throat> Since he's not giving me any crate nonsense, I don't, I don't ask for something that he doesn't know. Now, if he was doing crate nonsense that has nothing to do with the down, you know, I would know it correctly. Good boy. Good boy. Digging. Scratching at the floor. I don't mind if they do it a little bit. It's pretty natural, like a blanket, you know, but I don't have that kind of bedding, so I let that one go. But digging at the crate, chewing, 
barking, um, whining is a little bit more complicated. Um, it, it does, it does work. A, a, a small little correction, it does work on 90% of the dogs, but there are plenty of dogs who do not care, and so I don't push that. We'll work on that when the, the rest of their state of mind comes through the obedience and all the practicing calmness. So he's standing up. I'm not too concerned about it. He doesn't give me great nonsense. All right, so his, his behavior is dictating the training. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go, you know, I'm not gonna go train something and focus on it and attack it if it's an easy thing to shape up for him later when I teach him the down, right? Good oh boy. So it's this nice little, it's this nice little ebb and flow of I give you, I give you what do you give me. If you're working hard, we'll, we're gonna keep working. And then also, hey, that you know, you don't really want to do that. That's what I'm gonna. That's what we're gonna work on. Because that's what he needs to be better at. So basically, I, I just go right in with kind of what they're struggling with, um, but also shaping up the the basic obedience commands, right? Because this is a program, so you need to be able to kind of teach the clients a similar thing when they go home. Right? So you gotta shape it up a little bit, right? You gotta shape me up just like you gotta shape him up. Okay? You gotta stay sharp, buddy. Good job.